Well, apart from that gold BMW uh, M3, that was probably the most depressing start to a video I've ever done. And because it's so dark, grey and gloomy outside, I thought that I'd bring my optimism to this video, head into central London and do a bit of car spotting. It's Sunday and um, over the next couple of weeks I've got some uh, birthday family plans uh, in the next two weeks, which is meaning that I'm not going to be able to get that much chance to head into central London. Yesterday I heard that central London Knightsbridge was absolutely dead, there was no cars about, and um, I'm really going out on a whim here and driving into central London on a Sunday and hopefully Hopefully my bright blue car will be able to spice things up a little bit and um, I'm hoping that I can capture some really cool cars on camera and vlog at the same time so I bring you guys um, a whole array of different styles of videos today and throughout the whole week uh, dependent on what cars I see. So there we go, parked up, and uh, remember, I'm filming anything and everything that I think would be of interest. So uh, be prepared to see some odd cars. This is the world's largest bird ship. On a Fiat 500, and we've got a 458 just up here that we drove past in a lovely red. It's got nice interior as well. Italian stripe down the middle of the seats. If you know Yanni's car from Yanni Mai's, it's the same sort of seat. Oh, mistook that for an A45. Apologies.
So whilst I let the camera unblur or unfocus, maybe this is a quite a cool effect. Maybe you prefer it if I was blurry the whole time in my videos. Anyway, my day in London has finished and to be honest, it's much better than I was expecting. I'm glad that I was optimistic and came out even though it was gloomy when I left. It turned out to be a really nice day and that Dubai Porsche 918 to end it off and top it all off was fantastic. So highlight of the day, 918 by far. Had a great day, the weather was nice, I stayed dry, it was quite cold, but the main thing was that it didn't rain and we saw lots of supercars. So February's heating up quite nicely. I'm also gonna be doing a January highlights. How can I be doing a January highlights in mid-February? But I do want to create this competition of when's the best month to see supercars in London. And at the moment, January was quite good. I might mash up January and February together and bring that out at the end of February. So let me know what you think. Let me know what you think about the 918 as well, and then um, I'm hoping that that 918 video, uh, just that car video section, uh, comes out midweek. But now, for the long drive home, which will take about an hour, which will leave me perfect time for Top Gear. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog of uh, what it's like to spot on what looks to be a dark and gloomy day in February, I said gay dark and gloomy day in February turns out to be pretty damn good so thanks for watching make sure you subscribe and if you like it share it with your friends comment below what the best car that you think I saw was um, and yeah see you soon cheers